Hello everyone, welcome to Sweet Tomato Vine Homestead. How y'all doing? I'm Linda, and today I'm out in my chicken coop, and I am looking at these chickens experiencing some strange behavior. So y'all, what's going on with her? She done got out, and she's out. Done dug her a hole, taking a dust bath. I guess she said she wanted to be away from everyone else. But she is outside of the coop. So I guess this is another one gonna have to get her wings clipped. <laughs> Y'all know it's hot when the chicken just standing in the water. These two chickens right here getting so big, they begin to look like turkeys. Yeah, I don't know what kind of chicken Kane is. He a rooster, but he just got a strange look about him. Okay, y'all, I just came out to harvest the okra and then I'm going back inside because it has already begun to get very hot. So I will be out here just long enough to harvest this okra. Okay, y'all, that did not take long. Y'all, I am going to go in the house, 
put these in some vinegar and water and let them soak for a few hours. And then I'm gonna put them on the dehydrator after I season them with some oil. And uh, I'm gonna do salt and uh, onion powder and garlic powder. Cause uh, the last time I did not tell you all about uh, soaking them in the vinegar and water. And that is an important step. So y'all, I'm sorry. But, um, and I'm not gonna put the uh, smoke on there anymore because it gave mine a brown color and kind of, you know, it wasn't like I wanted. I wanted them to be more dry. But y'all, I did another batch and I did it differently. Like I told you, soaking the um, okra pods in the vinegar and water uh, for a few hours and then um, going ahead and putting some, I used, this time I went ahead and used some vegetable oil instead of the olive oil and I put a little salt on there and uh, onion powder and garlic powder and put them into the uh, dehydrator. And yeah, they was, the second batch was so much more delicious. I ate the first batch also, but the second batch was so much more delicious that I was eating them before they were uh, ready, y'all. So uh, that was just an amendment to my um, okra chips recipe. So y'all go ahead and try that and I think you'll like it. So I'm going to end the video right here because it is getting extremely hot right now and I'm going to get inside. So I hope that you all have a marvelous day. Go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell so you'll be notified when I upload a new video. I hope y'all have a marvelous day and thanks again for watching. Bye-bye.